there have been cases out there that a simple outdoor air tag was just dropped in a coat at a restaurant bar. Pennsylvania State Police are warning people about a tracking threat from Apple AirTag misuse. Now, Apple AirTags are billed as a cheap and easy way to keep track of items like your keys or your wallet. In recent months, though, there have been several reports of stalkers and thieves using those devices to track people. Fox 43's Richard Young Kunis reveals how you can avoid becoming a victim. Apple AirTags are designed to help you find lost items, but criminals are using them to stalk people. To show you how, I'm going to drive around Lancaster County with this device in my car. The iPhone this AirTag is connected to will stay about a mile away, tracking my every move. Nationwide, people are finding Apple AirTags hidden on their cars or in their belongings. It seems like it's happening to a lot of people, and I don't know if I'm in danger. Unsuspecting victims getting an alert on their phones hours later. A beeping sound leads them to the device. There have been at least two cases of unwanted Apple AirTag tracking in Pennsylvania. They're about the size of a quarter, so you could put it in a gas cap. There was a case recently out in uh, Bethlehem that the tracking device was actually put on the inside of a bumper um, by duct tape. Police say the victim in that case had an active protection from abuse order against the suspect for stalking. Mary Quinn, president and CEO of YWCA Greater Harrisburg, says tracking devices like this pose a serious threat to domestic violence victims. We do know that as technology kind of evolves, these issues kind of come to the forefront. Historically, we are very aware that a lot of our victims can be tracked by their perpetrators through their phones. We don't see as many stalking situations that are, are random, that are, you know, perpetrated by a stranger or individuals who don't have a relationship. Apple AirTags low cost now make tracking devices more accessible. And Fox 43 reveals there isn't much protection for victims. Is it illegal to, to track someone or does it really just come down to intent? Stalking cases are very unique. Right now, there's currently nothing uh, in the law that specifically um, is focused on Apple AirTags or a tracking device of that nature. State Representative John Galloway plans to introduce a bill to prohibit remote stalking with Apple AirTags. It's unclear when it will make it to the House. A map of AirTags path shows exactly where I drove around Lancaster County. The AirTags owner tracking me from at least six miles away. I didn't receive an alert until an hour later. There's a concern from Android users who don't have an iPhone. Uh, will they get that notification? Will they know that they're potentially being tracked by somebody? Uh, they will not. However, Android worked uh, with Apple to create the app Tracker Detect. Android users must proactively use that app to scan for nearby air tags. Turning off Bluetooth or location services won't prevent unwanted tracking. Fox 43 reveals the only way to disable the device is to find the AirTag, tap instructions to disable, and follow the steps on screen. Only then will the AirTag owner no longer get updates on its current location and yours. If you see an Apple AirTag that doesn't belong to you, that seems really suspicious, uh, contact your local law enforcement agency immediately. Every AirTag that is paired with an iPhone is associated with an Apple ID. Apple says they can provide those account details in response to a subpoena or valid request from law enforcement. And they have partnered with them on cases that led to an arrest and charges filed. Fox 43 reveals issues that affect you and your family to keep you informed. If you have a topic you want us to investigate, send me an email at fox43reveals at fox43.com.